My name is Dr. Dave Rosen. I'm a research scientist at the University of British Columbia. And I help run a rather unique research program using captive stellar sea lions in conjunction with the folks at the Vancouver Aquarium. In 1993, the University of British Columbia and three other universities started a captive stellar sea lion research program in order to understand why the population was declining in the wild. Since about the mid-70s, 85% of the stellar sea lions in Alaska have disappeared. Scientists don't know why. Part of trying to understand why stellar sea lions have disappeared in the wild, we brought sea lions into the Vancouver Aquarium. This is a really unique partnership where we have a private institution, the Aquarium, helping to run a private research program that's run by various universities. Scientists don't know exactly why stellar sea lions have disappeared, but they have a number of guesses, and that might relate to changes in the food they're eating in the wild, which might be related to changes in their climate or changes in the type of food that's just available out in Alaska. We know it's not just stellar sea lions that are disappearing. There's also harbor seals and northern fur seals and sea otters and a number of seabirds that are also disappearing. By bringing animals into the aquarium, we're able to do certain studies that we would be impossible to do with animals in the wild. We can change the type of food they're eating, we can change the type of experiences they have, the type of work they have to do, and we can measure their growth. Because these are trained animals, we can take a number of measurements and monitor them very, very closely to help determine what might affect their survival and their physiology. The great advantage of doing research at the aquarium is that we can use not just the aquarium's facilities, but also um, take advantage of their unique experience in dealing with marine mammals. So the stellar sea lions, although they're incredibly aggressive in the wild, what well, we have are trained animals. We use the aquarium's training staff, and so we can do things that you couldn't conceive of doing 10 years ago before we started this research program.